The original price of a t-shirt is $15. The sale price includes a 35% discount. What is the sale price? So if we take a look at this situation in picture form, uh, we know that the original price is $15. So let's fill that in. So my original price is always going to be thought of as my whole amount. Whatever I start with, that's always the whole. Um, and I know what that is as an amount. I know that that's $15. Sale price includes a 35% discount. So I am going to take away 35% of the cost of the item. Okay, and I don't know what that is as an amount at the moment, but I'll figure it out here in a second. And whenever I take away that 35%, you know, what I'm ended up paying, the portion of the item that I'm paying for would be 65%. 100% minus 35% is 65%. All right, so let's just figure out what this amount is. So this amount that I'm taking away is 35% of this 15. If we set up an equation, we have our part is equal to some percent of our whole. Our original price is our whole amount. So we're gonna plug $15 in right there. And uh, I know in some problems we have to be very careful about which of these percents we use. Um, it's actually, it technically doesn't matter on this one. We can just work with the number that they get, they've given us, the 35%. Just make sure that we understand that when we work with this number, that's going to tell us the amount of the discount. It's not going to be our final answer because our final answer wants to know sale price. So I have 35% of 15. So let's type that in. So 35% times 15 is $5.25. So my part. is $5.25, so that's, once again, that's the amount I'm taking away. Uh, so where am I ending here? So if I have 15, if I take away five, that would put me at 10. Take away another 25 cents. It looks like my sell price should be $9.75. Now, real quick, um, if you were thinking of doing this the other way, you could do it this way. Instead of saying 35% of the whole, you can say 65% of 15 will get, get me directly to this $9.75 because that's the portion of the item that I am uh, paying for. So just to show that, 0.65 times 15. And there's the $9.75.